Hey, what's up? Sean here. Just teeing up a little bonus content for you. I promised after our episode with James Herbert on Wednesday, in which I put him through the Gridgen Koloku gauntlet, a Hoop Grids inspired, Raptors inspired Hoop Grids game, uh, that I would drop the third Hoop Grid we did with him on that show that did not make the actual episode. Here it is. It's uh, James Herbert playing Gridgen Koloku, the best game in the world, the best named game in the world as well. Enjoy. Let's get to our final one, shall we? Uh, here we go. We've got a Raptor who only played for the Raptors top left. We have a Raptor who played for the Warriors top middle and a Raptor with a 20 plus point playoff game top right. Uh, in the middle, we've got all coached by Nick Nurse, a Raptor, a Warrior, and a 20-plus point playoff game guy. Uh, with Nick Nurse, we will allow the assistant coach uh, rule to be implemented here as someone who assisted for five years with the Raptors. Uh, so we'll yeah. add that to the mix of guys. And then Raptors playoff opponent. Uh, we've got, uh, again, a Raptor playoff opponent across the bottom who only who played for the Raptors. A, we got a Raptors playoff opponent who played for the Warriors and a Raptors playoff opponent who has a 20 plus point playoff game. Take it away. So will the, okay. So I have a question. Um, yeah. the Raptor with the 20 plus point playoff game, would that have had to happen in a Raptors uniform? Or at any point in their career, same thing with like playoff opponent, coach by Nick Nurse. Uh, like we're going at any point in their career. It doesn't have to be with the team. Okay. And coach by Nick Nurse would not include current Sixers who have not actually. They have played not played games yet. with him yet. It's still possible he runs himself out of town before the season begins. So, uh, no, not yet. <laughs> I I don't anticipate that happening. Um, I don't either. Let's but go whatever. with. <laughs> let's go with Alfonso McKinney in the middle. In the middle square? In the middle square, a warrior coached by Nick Nurse. That is correct. Alfonso McKinney. He was, of course, on the Raptors during Nick Nurse's uh, assistant coaching time. Well done. Good rarity the, score. 1.0. The, mid <laughs> the middle bottom square. Let's go with Quinn Cook. Ooh, Quinn Cook. Great call. Um, like the third best player on that Warriors team by the time the series ended on account of all the injuries. Uh, well done to Quinn Cook. <clears throat> The list of Warriors who played too many minutes in that series. Quinn Cook, DeMarcus <laughs> Cousins, McKinney, actually. Um, yep. I remember Kawhi's eyes lighting up every time McKinney was, like, guarding him. <laughs> no, like, just going to shoot right over him every time. Um, okay. Uh, a Raptor who played for the Warriors who is not, but not tied to the playoffs or Nurse. Okay, so I have a lot more sort of real estate to go with there. Um the first name that just popped in my head for that, I think, is wrong, so I don't want to say it. Um, okay. I'll tell you what it was later, but I okay, I, that's fine. I don't trust. I don't trust myself whatsoever. Okay. Um, a raptor with a twenty-plus point playoff game. Let's think, because are there weird raptors who have a twenty-plus point playoff game, or are they all exactly the ones you would expect? I know. Biombo had a crazy rebounding playoff game, but he definitely twenty six rebounds. Yeah, exactly. But that <clears throat> I'm I'm thinking about playoff heroes, and I don't think he would count there. Um, I'll I'll, I'll just go Norman Powell. Norman Powell is correct. Definitely did that. Uh, I'm sure uh, every time he played the Bucks is the exactly. exact number of times he did that. Yeah. Uh, Buck all right, Norman Powell is in the books. You are three for three. Um, coached by Nick Nurse for the Raptors, um, but let's think of a weirdo. Um, oh, who's the guy that I always really liked? Oh, um, let's go with Malcolm Miller. I always liked him. Malcolm Miller, love it. That is correct. Uh, you're now four for four, you got five left. What you, where, where are you going now? You've got a, a Raptor who was only a Raptor, a Raptor who was a Warrior, a 20 plus point playoff game guy who was coached by Nick Nurse a Raptors playoff opponent who also played for the Raptors, and a Raptors playoff opponent with a 20-plus point playoff game. This is a little risky because, like, I'm remembering some big games that he had, but I can't be completely positive that he had 20-plus, but I'm, I'm positive enough. I'm going to go with the, the, the middle right column, coached by Nick Nurse, 20-plus point playoff game. I'll go Serge Ibaka. Serge Ibaka, uh, uh, that can't be wrong. Uh, I'm pretty sure he had 20 in the clinching game of the finals, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, but let's let's pull that up. I was thinking more sure. about that that Sixers game where like nobody else was making anything and he was making yeah, a bunch yeah. of big shots. 
He definitely had himself. Let's go career playoff game log for old Serge Ibaka. And going back to his days with the uh, Thunder, he certainly would have had him as well. Yeah, he had a 27 uh, against the Nets in 2020. He had 23 against the Cavs in 2017. He had 23 against the Wizards in 2018. Uh, multiple 20-point games with OKC. He also had 22 in a game against the Brooklyn Nets. And yeah, uh, 20... 20 in game three, I think it was, against the Warriors as well. So, uh, looking good. Uh, game four it was, sorry, when the Raptors took the, th- the, the, the 3-1 lead. Serge Ibaka had that crazy third quarter. Uh, so that's correct. You are 5-4-5. Five, five. You got four picks left. Okay. Um, a Raptors playoff opponent um, who was also a member of the Raptors. Um, that's, a, that's actually kind of fun one. Um, it is, isn't it? Well done, me. <laughs> the first one that's popping to my mind is from a while ago. And uh-huh. I hope I'm not. I'm hope. I'm hoping I'm not messing this up. Oh, but what if he were on there after the period of the series that I'm thinking of? Oh boy, that that could be. No, he wasn't. Okay, um, I'm gonna go Hito Turkaloo. Hito Turkaloo. Uh, oh, you're thinking the 08 Magic, correct? Yeah. Yeah, I believe unless he wasn't there. unless he hadn't made it to the magic by then, then I'm wrong and then I I'm an idiot and I shouldn't have done that. I that's that's a good question. Let's pull this up. We're looking at the 0708 team. Uh 0708. Yes, he was on the Orlando Magic. He led the NBA in games played that year, full 82. He got the little black yeah. gold mark on basketball reference. Good for him. Uh too bad I feel he like was that's a good rarity score. when he started out with the Raptors. That is pretty good. Yeah. He you know, Thurgood. Quite quite impressive. Uh all right. That's your Raptors opponent playoff opponent with a twenty plus point playoff game, or uh, just Raptors uh, playoff opponent? Playoff opponent. Okay. I don't want to go so far as to assume he had it. I mean, he probably did, but I don't <laughs> know. Um, twenty plus point playoff game. Um, oh, I I just thought of a really good one, but then it wasn't so much the amount of points as like the big shots and him being a jerk. So I don't want to do it. Uh, okay. Let's go. Oh man, I no, that's too risky. I'll, mm-hmm. I'll just, I'll just, I'll, <laughs> having a dialogue with myself. This is not, this is not good podcasting. Um, I'll stick I think with this that one Orlando is the, series. Like the widest range of guys, I'm pretty sure that you could go. With. I know, but that's why it's wide like cool. It's, it's hard yeah. to narrow down. Um, I'll, just, I'll go Dwight Howard. I'll just stick with that old playoff. Series. Dwight Howard, yeah. Uh, I, I'm assuming he had a 20 point playoff game at some point. Dwight Howard is correct. Bit of a coward's pick. I wonder if Jameer Nelson would have been a better selection, but that's just me. Um, what do you got? Top two. What you need a Raptor you... who played only for the Raptors. You can't pick Vincenzo Esposito on this one. I'm pulling rank. Uh, <laughs> and a Raptor who um, played for the Warriors. Raptor who only played for the Raptors. Um, actually, I'll go. What if this is wrong, though? Ah, yeah, if what it's if wrong, it's, wrong? it's cool. It's if it's wrong, it's it's wrong in a fun way. Um, I'll go Monk Batur. Oh, I'm pretty sure that's wrong because I seem it... to recall him being on the Mavericks for a time. But really, uh, let's see. In fact, Monk Batur played for three t- three t- not the Mavericks, the Nuggets, the Spurs, and the Raptors. So Spurs? just seven games with the Raptors. Yeah, twelve oh games God. in o two o three. Does that mean he has a championship ring? <laughs> was he on the team at the end? Uh, I mean, he should just get it for being on the team for 12 games, I would say. But uh, it's, No. He does, not, I don't think he's... Not, yeah, not 2003 true. NBA champ. He has it on his basketball reference page, so good for him. Wow, congratulations um, to him and shame on me. NBA champion. Yeah. Not with the Raptors. Your immaculate grid has fallen apart. You, uh, you got one pick left. Are you going for the Raptor who only played for the Raptors or a Raptors Warriors guy is your last pick here? Uh, I'll go for... I guess I'll go for a Raptors Warriors guy. Um, okay. As I am now racking my brain for this was, your... I think, a thing that was needed on hoop grids like two days ago at Raptor, who played for the Warriors. Really, I wonder yeah. who I used that. Um, <laughs> I'll tell I you who I used after you pick. <clears throat> yeah, I don't. Um, There's a couple good you... ones. Like good, as in very. A couple weird. like yeah, like good rarity score guys. Yeah. There's got to be. Um, you might as well be. aim to juice the rarity score here as well, considering you can't go immaculate anymore. 
Thanks. Thanks for reminding me how that. Yeah, no worries. I'm, my, I'm just here to serve. No, I don't even know if he actually played for the Warriors, but I think he did. I think I might have used this guy the other day. Uh, Benoit Benjamin. Benoit Benjamin. I also used this guy the other day. Uh, I think for a like a. Sonic I've just used Raptors him so many like things. Or Thunder Raptors. Uh, Benoit Benjamin did not play for the Warriors. You could have ah, gone well. Chris Garner. You could have gone. Oh my God. Uh, Chris Boucher, of course. You could have gone yeah, Patrick that's too O'Brien. Obvious. Pat you could have gone Marco be, Bellinelli. Marco Bellinelli yeah. was another one. Uh, no, either way, James. Yeah, that's a pretty good one, too. Either way, James, uh, you did a damn good job.